buddy. I don't feel good. Whatever. It's actually been about three months since we were out on our 12 day adventure. I know, I know, I know, stay with me, stay with me. So the point of this particular episode, I wanted to jump in and create some more context is we got food poisoning while we were out on the adventure, which you guys are going to see just in a moment. But the whole concept of documenting this particular episode is hopefully to give people a first-hand look on how dangerous uh, foodborne illness or any other type of illness could become out in the wild for any situation. Whether you're camping, hiking, or in a survival situation, it doesn't matter. Comparatively, being in a city or a town in your normal everyday environment where you can go get medical help anytime you need. And because we were filming a YouTube video and it was a survival challenge, I was in contact with my wife, aka Outdoor Mama, and I was also in contact with my nurse friend and spoke to them and said, hey, um, we're not feeling very good. We've had, we believe we have food poisoning. We've thrown up in a diarrhea a few times. And if, and I set myself up on kind of like a check-in thing, like every two or three hours. And I told them, if I miss a check-in for any reason, I want you guys to come pull me out because I may have passed out or things gotten worse. And I, well, you'll see. I don't feel good. Mm. Mm. Uh, not to mention I got like really cold last night. Like I, I checked my phone, which, which I'm filming on. And it got to like 30 something last night, which was insanity. It's been like mid 80s every day. Last night that wind, oh God, it was so crazy. But I had the emergency blanket and I just wrapped up in my sleeping bag and kind of just been huddled up. But my stomach hurts too, and I've had diarrhea. Oh, I guess not a, it's not a, not a, not a good day today. I don't really feel like eating or drinking anything though. But I know with diarrhea, it can get dangerous. So I keep drinking my water which I think helps because it's, it's not making it worse at least so I know the filtered water is working at least a little bit I got the fire going back there this morning and I was scared to catch this on fire or something so I had to go without it which made it really cold but at least I've been keeping the fire so it's, you know, it's not too hard to just keep putting wood on it it's just this cold weather is not helping I don't know if the hot weather would be any better to be honest though Um, I don't I'm not gonna quit this this is stupid I, I I think my last one when I got sick like five months ago was way worse Chris you okay Chris uh oh Chris you okay get all that puking out of your system Chris he's not in there huh Still diarrhea. I got a little, little sappy in the middle of the night, man. Mm. I got most of this stuff right here. And this is my tripod. Ignore that. I don't know if oh. I gotta go to the bathroom, but I don't want to move. But I need to go because it's not number one. I gotta go brave this. <sighs> I'll put you guys like right here. I don't have a tripod for it.
That was that was gross. Whatever. Oh. Take your one. I don't know if I felt better or worse. I'm empty. I'm gonna try to see if I can sleep a little bit. See if I can sleep some of this off, maybe. I think I need more firewood. And smoke's going down. Oh. I don't want to move. Ugh. I threw up a little bit ago. I uh, I attempted to eat some soup, but it didn't take. Kind of. Mostly slept all day. I don't feel any better. The only thing I can keep down is water. <sighs> you know. <sighs> if I don't feel better in the morning, I don't want to quit or leave or anything, but I'm going to just because diarrhea and vomiting, I just don't want it to get dangerous for no reason. Hmm. But. I'm just trying to think about what it is because I'm trying to thoroughly cook the food, drink filter water. I don't, I don't get it. But I've got the emergency blanket and my jacket and this. I'm doing okay. And I got a fire going. I'm only like five feet away from it. It's not too bad. But it's supposed to... Uh, get like really cold like like 38 tonight but the emergency blanket and everything I, I should be okay I'm not worried about that I'm just I'm still not feeling good and, and uh, I still I want to eat but I'm afraid I can't keep it down all I've been doing is drinking water It was like 11.45. I'm just doing everything I can to uh, try to keep the fire going so I don't have any spoiled food or anything because 
I have a lot of work tomorrow to do. I have to get more water and all that stuff. But I just hope I feel better in the morning. I've shown up twice and I've gone to the bathroom. I don't know, like six. Like six or seven times today. I'm not trying to whine or complain, I'm just... Hopefully... I appreciate you guys that are sticking with the video and watching it though. Hopefully if you guys saw a mistake I made as far as like... I don't know, like washing hands or... I don't know, anything that I don't... I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Could come from anything, I guess. Uh, could have came from skinning the animal yesterday or uh, anything. Hold on. I'm gonna get ready to go back to sleep. Hold on. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in here. So I can turn it off. Ugh. I'm not any good at this without a tripod. Yeah, this is gonna be a crappy video. Ugh. But yeah. Hopefully I can get rid of whatever it is. I'm gonna keep this with me so it doesn't freeze. Oh. Oh. Alright guys. Mm. I'm gonna try to go to bed now.